And that's your Rush Block. I'm Liza Lucas here at the 11 Alive Bridge tracking what's trending in the conversation after Texas puts a full stop on red light cameras. Governor Greg Abbott signing a ban on red light cameras in that state. We want to hear from you this morning. Should Georgia do the same? Our poll is live. You can head over using our app to vote and weigh in. The technology can record license plates and automatically issue drivers tickets. Many city officials and local law enforcement in Texas oppose the bill. Now they argue the cameras reduce deadly accidents and generate additional revenue from those tickets, while others question the fairness of the cameras. The cameras catch people not just running the red light, but those who stopped just over the white line who didn't quite clear the intersection. Now, Georgia does allow red light cameras, but I checked GDOT's latest report this morning, and only a handful of cities still use those systems. But what's the reaction to Texas's news this morning? Well, I got this tweet in from Sandy. She said it was crazy. She says running red lights is pretty clear violation of the law and other safety. Now, other people kind of bringing up the other side of the coin that sometimes when people are aware of those cameras, they make a very quick stop on yellow causing people to rear end behind them. So a lot of conversations being had about safety. James saying when it comes to the revenue, that should not be a case for the argument, guys. Yeah, it's uh, the technology is still kind of lacking because people that do, you pull up and if you're just over that white line there, it could give you, it'll trigger it and give you a ticket. Whereas you get a, pulled over by a police officer, yeah, sometimes you can say, hey, the guy in front of me didn't do that and I didn't know whether I should go or stop and, yeah. you know, maybe so. So I could see where the technology is still a little bit of a problem. Even people making right hand turns yeah. would get tickets for getting a, a running a red light. So I'm which kind of legal, yeah. Which, right, which is legal in most states. I'm kind of for it. Uh, I, I think it helps to police some of the areas where people do purposely blow through those red lights or gun it when they hit the yellow. But again, the technology is just, uh, that's mm. the problem right there. Are you surprised that te that Texas went to this? I was very surprised, yeah, I really was. Because, I mean, they really have them out there. And, and they're out in L.A. as well. A lot of big cities have a lot of these red light cameras. So to slowly see states, I think, what are we up to, like 15 or 16 states now are banning them. Uh -huh. that's, I, I don't know if that's the, the right move right now. I think they should work with it more. Mm. No, I've been hit. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Marietta has uh, one. <laughs> <laughs> Do tell. Uh, know exactly where it is, the oh, intersection yeah, yeah. of. They'll send you a, yeah. uh, a picture mm -hmm. of your car and the light to show you that you're, I got hit in Philly too, uh, but that was also making a turn. Uh, okay. um, so they let that one go. But uh -huh. uh, yeah, I've been hit twice. I've been mm. hit twice by the cameras. I, it doesn't bother me. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's a help. If you're in violation, you're in violation. So yeah. I was guilty there of There was an interesting thing in the article that said, what if you're not driving your car? Someone has to go and fight this yeah, ticket it, if you're not the driver. So mm. it takes it, more time off you. work. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I did that to a friend of mine. I was borrowing her car and went through the Georgia 400 toll plaza and blew through it and she got the ticket. Mm. Well, we have posted a full article on 11alive.com. Hopefully you paid her, Crash. Keep voting on our news app or 11alive.com.